It's a uh, revolver, 38. Glow is 16, and this is his sixth gun. So why do they call you Glow? Because I light up the night. <laughs> How's that? <laughs> with the pipe. Like, with the weapon. Yeah, with that, the weapon. That's yeah. the pipe. Yeah. He says a pipe, a gun, is easy to find. He bought his illegally from a friend. He's had one since he was 11. You carry a gun? Yes. Why? To protect myself, because I lost a lot of friends. And I don't want to be the one to go down, murder, slaughter. So I got to protect myself anywhere as possible. The last time he fired it, two days ago, when a rival gang member fired at him from a car. And I let a couple of shots off at it. So you fire off a couple of warning shots? Yes. Glow is hardly alone in carrying a weapon. A recent study by Northwestern University found that 9% of high school students in Chicago carry guns. That's compared with 4% in New York City and 6% in Los Angeles. The study's co-author says that is largely because Chicago is more segregated, more dysfunctional, and more violent. They're doing it for protection because you're constantly having to watch your back. Otherwise, you're just a, a victim that's going to be out there uh, as easy prey. So you have stress, anxiety, stress, anxiety, unrelenting, unrelenting. This is Glow's school, Marshall High School in Chicago's gritty East Garfield Park neighborhood. He says among his friends, three out of five carry a gun to school every day. They would rather get caught with the gun than get caught without the gun because if four or five people were to attack them, they can kind of defend themselves. That doesn't make it right, but the reality is everyday life in the ghetto. The victims include the armed students themselves. We worry about how their brain is developing and that it doesn't develop fully and it doesn't, it, it, it's more always kind of turned on and revved up and so you have this hyper responsiveness. Um, so sometimes kids become more aggressive. You have the opposite too, that some kids will become more depressed and socially withdrawn. Glow says for him, it's a matter of daily security. What if you weren't in a game? Would you still feel like you need the protection? Yes, because a lot of stuff going on out here in the streets of Chicago. A lot of people getting robbed, raped, you feel me? A lot of things. So I got to protect myself to get, get home to my family. After school, he hopes to move to a place that's just a few kilometers from here, but in terms of safety, a whole world away. Downtown Chicago. John Hendren, Al Jazeera, Chicago.